All right, well, the dinner made went well. We're sitting in line at uh, Dutch Bros for coffee and gonna go down and see some really, really cute Italian greyhounds like this one over here for at a play date. Hello. Hello. How are you guys? Good. Yeah, thank you. There's Tino. He's like, I hate these things. Well, maybe not. They are just having a good time. Don't pee on the camera. Yes. Hello. Hello. Yes. Oh, sweet girl. There's Tino. There's Tino. You're actually playing today. What's up with that? Huh? Not hiding behind her legs. Yeah, sure. We know. Find out how it works. It's like, you know, it's gone today. Well, hello. There's a puppy. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. I love these get togethers. I love them. They're so good. Uh oh. Oh, hi, Henry. There's a new puppy. Of all shapes and sizes. <laughs> okay, so we saw on Facebook about this whole soda over the egg for 24 hours. You take the glass off at the end and it's just like a jelly egg. Freaks me out. So I decided I needed to try it myself because I don't believe anything I see on the internet. So, <laughs> soda just got, I don't know, I probably can't show the label on the internet. I don't know. Got Coca-Cola. Um, egg, regular old organic. You can hear the yolk if you were here. It's not hard boiled or anything. Just regular egg. Putting the soda over it. But when I posted this on my Facebook page, said I'm trying this. Someone, my sister, said, well, the only time I drink soda is with whiskey. So I was like, I'm going to try that too. Unfortunately, all of our whiskey is kind of expensive whiskey, and I'm not going to waste it. <laughs> but I do have some cheap vodka. <laughs> so vodka and Coke. Mm. Vodka, well, vodka soda. Well, vodka soda, okay. Still, it's a liquor. Will it make any kind of difference whatsoever? So, you know. Like a little vodka with my coke, okay. Ugh. You're not drinking that, are you? No. Okay. Just testing. And then I was curious. Purposes. I was curious. Is it just carbonation or is it the soda? So did a soda stream. You can see the bubbles. Carbonated water. Put just carbonated water in this one. So we are going over to Dieter's house tonight for a bring and bry. He's South African, and a bring and bry is essentially a reason to get around a charcoal grill and make meat and then people bring extra stuff desserts and side dishes so this is a lamb shoulder i've uh rolled rosemary over it uh, with my trusty pestle and then i'm going to add a little tony's seasoning a little black pepper and then a little kelp just a little bit of kelp it's a good mommy flavor and we'll take these over and grill those tonight over there and have some bry yumminess. Wow, Tanya's making pod thai salad or kind of a cold peanut, cold salad. peanut salad. So we'll see how that, that, that's always good. Peanuts, noodles, can't beat it. There's our god boy. 
Yes, yeah, back from London and Scotland. Yes, look at those tefers. They're coming in. This is one of our simple oh pleasures. A uh, so uh, beautiful baby boy. Yes, look at him. He's a he's a camera hound. He's work it, work it, boy, work it. Yes, we're over Dieter's right now. It's kind of having the fire is on and. The grill is going to be going hot here pretty soon, so we're going to put some of those lamb chops or lamb uh, shoulder chops on and eating some really good food. That's good, thank you. Oh, and Shandy, Dieter's dog, just loves Campbell. Look at him, look at him. Go, go over there, get over there. Yeah! <laughs> what a pun -um. What a pun -um. What a happy boy. <laughs> yes. These again. Oh my god. They're they're so good. I love the lime and the lemon and the orange keys. They taste so good. Yama lama. Yama lama. Kids are such a simple pleasure. When they're happy. <laughs> He's a happy boy. Dieter's Bry and Bry is bringing Bry at South Africa and it's essentially get together and cook meat and maybe bring some side dishes so here's Dieter this is his place this is uh, Villa Lombardi beautiful space and some wonderful people bringing more meat to cook meat and meat and meat and then there's some little table of cocktails and wine and a little beer some dogs, just good people eating meat. So this is the perfect bring and bry, just diversity of meat on a grill. Oh God, look at that. This is called burn. It's burn. It's burn. It's called char and flavor. What happens when we're not watching it? That's what happens. You need to watch it. And then we got some Bruderwash. Bruderwash? Bruderwash. And then got chicken. It's a crapshoot. It's meat on fire. It's not bad, right? You can't have any bad. What happened to That's an ENFP. Really? Okay, so this is Dieter's place. He's from South Africa. I've worked with him over the years, and friends of friends of friends have worked with him, and now we're, we're season two, 2019. So uh, he's from South Africa. He'll, he'll explain what a bring and braai is. Okay. So this is a bring and braai. So you almost need to, you, you can look at me, but also you need to zoom over. Because that's really what it is. It's a smor it's a smorgasbord of meat. We get together. You bring your meats. There is buravosh, there is peri peri chicken, there is lamb, there is steak, there's kebabs, and you put it on the fire and it's all about enjoying a good time with friends. So a simple and savored pleasure of friends, food and drink. That's it. Friends, food and drink. Oh, I love That's that. what it's about. Uh, you know what? There's plenty of meat. <laughs> lots of meat, lots of friends. We're meeting new friends. And how primal is this, you know? Look at that. It's lovely. Oh, at any uh, bring and bry, there's always these wonderful desserts, kind of a custardy and a mint thing. And then we got. Uh, mint cream to mint shots kind of stuff so very 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 good so Dieter's working his magic and what is this called again Dieter? Spring Bucky. it's a, a mint and amarula which is a coffee cream liqueur very South African we've grown very fond of these quite lovely You really are? So we're still at Dieter's. Maybe winding down. Brian, Dieter, Tanya, and I are still here. And Tracy, kind of. Brian's talking about hitting the hot tub. Brian's going to hit the hot tub. 
we're talking about heading home and just loving sitting in front of fire listening to 80s dance music. It's one of the simple, savored things of life. Good music, good friends, and a fire. Life is good. <laughs>